This piece of land that you see on your screen has changed the world we live in. This is Silicon Valley, a region in the southern part of the San Francisco Bay Area in California. It serves as a global center for high technology innovation and is valued at almost $3 trillion today. But this was not always the case. So today, in this video, we take a trip inside Silicon Valley and see what made this area one of the most valued pieces of land in the world today. Let's start. Located in the southern part of the San Francisco Bay Area, Silicon Valley cities include Sunnyvale, Redwood City, Mountain View and other popular areas. It is home to many of the world's largest tech companies including Apple, Google, Tesla and Meta with headquarters of more than 30 businesses in the Fortune 1000. Silicon Valley alone accounts for one third of all venture capital investment in the US. This has helped it to become a leading hub and startup ecosystem for high-tech innovation. It even has a super hit comedy show based on it from HBO. This area has a very interesting story, starting with the military. The Bay Area had long been a major site for US Navy research and technology. In 1909, Charles Herald started the first radio station in the country, the rights to which were purchased by a Stanford University graduate who founded Federal Telegraph Corporation, popularly known as FTC, in Palo Alto. Over the next decade, the FTC created the world's first global radio communication system. The earlier mentioned Stanford University has played a major role in the development of this area. After World War II, Frederick Terman, Stanford University's Dean of School of Engineering, encouraged faculty and graduates to start their own companies. He is credited with nurturing companies like Hewitt Packard, Eastman Kodak, General Electric and other tech firms. This led to the area around Stanford University to grow and eventually turn into today's Silicon Valley. The word Silicon in the name refers to the large number of innovators and manufacturers in the region that specialize in silicon-based transistors and integrated circuit chips. The development of this technology became the focus of startup companies in California, such as Fairchild and Intel, fueling the technological and economic growth of what would later be called Silicon Valley. Although semiconductors are still a major component of the area's economy, Silicon Valley has been most famous in recent years for its software and internet services. The area has significantly influenced computer operating systems, software and user interface. This was only fueled by the rise of internet in 1990. Commercial use of the internet became practical and grew slowly throughout the early 1990s. But in 1995, its use grew substantially and the initial wave of internet startups like Amazon and eBay began operations. The area is generally considered to have been the center of dot-com bubble which started in the mid-1990s. During this time, its prices reached unprecedented levels. Even till this day, Silicon Valley has some of the highest real estate prices in the world. Now all things considered, there is a lot of debate around why Silicon Valley is a success and why other places have failed to replicate it. One reason is network. It is a close-knit community of tech professionals and students going as far back as their university years at Stanford. So it makes perfect sense to stay close to your contacts. Those around you could help you develop new products using their tech. Take the PayPal Mafia for example. Another reason is diversity. There are many universities packed with highly qualified students filled with ambition who want to change the world. Plus their different backgrounds, nationalities and cultures make it a recipe of success. So it's logical that companies that invested in the valley once are willing to do it again. Silicon Valley provides growth potential for existing tech giants and is home to thousands of startups with game-changing ideas. So it is safe to say that this area will continue to grow and lead the world in innovation as it has done for the past decade. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, do drop in a like and subscribe for the channel. Thank you for watching.